everybody, my name is Banish. We're back here playing some Minecraft, but today we are doing some furniture. And I've never done this before, but I built this house, and um, I might as well give it a shot while I have the chance. Um, while I remember this. Um, so yeah, why don't we just get started here? Um, so if you guys enjoyed this video, then uh, go ahead and leave a like. And, uh, maybe if you enjoyed it so much that you want to hit the subscribe button, you know, I'll be, I'll be fine with that, you know, I, I, I ain't complaining, I ain't complaining, but if you guys can hear, um, you might probably not, because that, you, prob just, you probably just won't, but I am using the blue snowball, um, microphone, I just got this today, and I'm super happy with the quality it has given me. Um, and yeah, I just, I'm just really happy that I got it. And, um, yeah, with all of that put aside, I think we should start by, so, let's see. This is a very small house. This is, uh, just made for the two people. Um, the standard, um, two people hut right here, folks, 22K16. Um, but yeah, let's get started with making a very miniature kitchen with the furnace. Um, so, yeah, by the way, um, this texture pack is Finn's Graphics. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to give it to you. Um, but it's called the Infinite Texture Pack, I think? I'm not sure. Wait, let me just check. Uh, yeah, Infinite. Um, it's a really good texture pack, and, um... The person who made it is just really talented, and, uh, Finn's graphics, you guys can check him out, link in the description, he makes awesome texture packs, and is, he's just, he's just really good at what he does, and so, uh, yeah, um, let's stop rambling on and get to what we're supposed to be doing in this video, um, let's see, let's go ahead and have, at had, yes, let's go ahead and had some coal, um, blocks, I don't, I don't understand why nobody puts coal blocks in there. Like, of all, all of my friends, like, none of them put coal blocks. I don't understand. Anyways, um, and now that that's there, we should put crafting table. There it is. So, yeah, um, I downloaded the 3D, um, version. Uh, I think it looks super sick. You did a great job on it. Um, yeah, so that is cool, too. Um, let's see if I can... Find something that will look somewhat like a counter. Possibly a piston. Possibly. I'm not sure. Hmm. I mean... I wonder if I can, like... Hold on. Let me try if I can... I've seen this bef done before. And I think it looks pretty cool. And then you put, like, I think carpet or slab. I'm just gonna try carpet for now, and I'm gonna slab just in case. Um, I'm, I i don't know if you guys know what I'm doing. It's like that, I think. Yeah, I think it was like that. And then you had a door going that way. And then... That, that is a little awkward. Hmm. M maybe not. Poss- I don't know. Um... Maybe just one there, and then, um, I'm not sure, hmm, um, as you can tell, I'm very, uh, noobish at, um, decorating, um, on camera, I normally do this off camera, um, every time I build a house, but, um, you know, I decided to do something different, because I miss you guys, honestly, I haven't been posting for a while now, um, there's a very good reason. I'm pretty sure you guys know what this reason is. It is called school. Um, I'm not sure if you guys, like, have school or not. If you don't have school, then I have no idea why you're watching this video, because you should want you should be watching someone professional. And by professional, I mean, that's not me. I'm not professional. What are you talking about? No. Yeah. So, let's see if I can find something that could simulate a countertop. I mean, a piston could work, but what if you put a carpet on top of it? That doesn't look too bad. That scares me. Er, Tim. 
Eritim. So I think we can put like um maybe a light here, like a cauldron, and then the leaves, and then the um, what's it called? The glow. Oh no, the sea lanterns. Sea lanterns. Yes, yeah, sea lanterns are a very beautiful thing. I am so hype for um one point um nine. Yeah, I think that looks sick. I know I said this is gonna be miniature, um, kitchen. Turns out it's not so miniature anymore. Um, maybe that's just because, you know, people like to eat. Like, people love to eat. So I think that's gonna be it for the kitchen, unless I put, like, I don't know, a, like, I think this is called an island. I'm not sure. I think this is where you put the cakes and stuff. Um, but yeah, I think that looks pretty good for now. What if we put a couple of chairs now i'm not sure if i'm the only one who does chairs like this but it's not necessarily just the regular stair i mean i could do the stair but it seems too like average and normal for me i'm a very odd person and i like to do odd things so this is right up my alley see i, I don't necessarily like to do the chairs like this i mean it does look very appealing like it looks better than the average chair you just can't sit in it it sit in it properly so i like to do what is called the um, actually i don't know what this is called i found it somewhere off the internet props to whoever made it i i have no idea who made it but i think you put one here and then it glitches through and then you put one here and you put one here well, well that glitches out anyway you put two here and it kind of makes like a like a little chair stool thing i don't know what that's necessarily called but since it's made for two people why don't we just make a double chair which we have done there so i think we can make this like the uh the, like the tv slash kitchen room or not kitchen kitchen over there i think this should be like the living room possibly so i think we can make this into a tv now i'm not sure like how to necessarily make a tv um, but with this texture pack and the site looks, it, it suffices. Hmm, who knew? Um, let's get a couple of gray carpets up in here. And let's put you like that. Um, how about we put like, <gasps> excuse me. There you go. Um, what if we put like two lovers here? Like the old, <laughs> what is wrong? Like the old fashioned, uh, Oh, I love the old-fashioned TVs. They were so hideous, but they were so fun to look at. Like, can anybody agree with me on that? Like, they were so hideous, but they were so, like, awesome. You know what I mean? I, I'm pretty sure you guys don't know what I mean. Now, I feel like a nerd, which I am. I'm not afraid to admit that I'm a nerd. And if anybody is a nerd and they're afraid to admit it, don't, don't be afraid. I'm a nerd. <laughs> that moment when Spongebob says, I'm ugly and I'm proud. <laughs> Life lesson to kids. Be ugly and be proud. <laughs> what is the point of that episode? I don't understand. But, um... That looks pretty swag. I'm not gonna lie here. That looks pretty swag. Swag, swaggity, swag, swag. The only time, um, I think I will actually use that, um... That stair, um... Uh, the stair, like, I, I can't, like, the stair, um, seats. The, I think the only time I'll actually use stairs and, like, a, um, well, since the theme is, like, wood and, like, naturous, why don't we use, like, a jungle wood? Possibly? And then we put, like, signs here. Hmm? Like, like so. Oh, I think I think this color blends in well with the uh, other atmosphere of the. Yeah, yeah, I think that looks pretty cool. You just hop into the chair and you hop out. That looks pretty cool. Looks pretty swag. Um, let's go ahead and add the signs. Can you just like exit out? Oh, you can. That seemed a lot easier than it actually was. Okay. Um, let's see. Maybe we can put like um. Like a little coffee desk here, so let's get the jungle wood, uh, jungle wood, um, slabs. Let's 
go ahead and place those. That looks that looks pretty cool. You'd be rather close to the TV, but um, it, it'll make do for now. Um, yeah, so let's see what this looks like from the outside. Make sure it doesn't cover anything up too horribly. Cover The TV covers up a little bit. Oh, yeah. So, um, I built this house, and, um, the inspiration from this house was actually, um, a YouTuber I watch, or watched, um, his name is Devin Crawford, um, you can guys, look, you guys can look him up, or maybe I'll put the link in the description if I remember or not, um, he's just, uh, he's just a great YouTuber, and, um, he just went past through, like, like, high school mess, and, yeah, so, Going through the same boat as him, studying hard. You know, you know how it is. If you're in school or not, I don't know. Why? I don't know why you'd be in high school watching this video. You're basically watching a 12-year-old playing Minecraft. I don't understand. I just don't. But um, I try to make the best content for you guys um that I can with what I have, and um, I think we did a pretty good job. To be honest with you, I think this turned out well. Um, as you can see, guys, look, we have 40 frames. That is awesome, dude. Freaking awesome. I had, um, 200 frames, um, until, like, expl- Just- <laughs> On the frames. Sorry if that was loud. Um, I have tested the blue snowball, and it sounds amazing, but I think this is gonna be the end of the episode, and if you guys would want some more of these, uh, random building series, then go ahead and leave a like on this video, and, uh, maybe a comment saying that you would, um, want me to uh, do more of this but anyways guys hopefully you enjoy remember you like and slap that like button with any body part you currently own or maybe you preserve body parts i don't know i don't judge people okay you can do whatever you want all right i don't judge especially with literally every bandage that is on my body <laughs> get it get it bandage, get it get it <laughs> anyways um so yeah if you guys like this video don't forget to leave a like and smash that like button and uh I will see you guys in future videos. Bye!